Could falling off a ladder turn an ordinary man into an extraordinary psychic? This is the curious tale of Peter Herkos, a man who claimed to have developed psychic abilities after a near-fatal accident. Born Peter van der Herk in the Netherlands, Herkos led a life that was anything but ordinary. His journey into the world of the psychic and paranormal began in 1941, when a fall from a ladder while working as a painter resulted in a brain injury. Following this incident, he claimed to have developed psychic abilities. Herkos's abilities soon caught the attention of many, and he came to the United States in 1956 to participate in psychic experiments. His unique talents would eventually lead him to work on some of the most notorious crime cases of the 20th century. In 1964, he gained widespread attention when Attorney General Edward W. Brooke of Massachusetts said Herkos had come uncannily close to describing the person suspected of strangling 11 women in Boston. This was the infamous Boston Strangler case, a horrific series of murders that had the city gripped in fear. Herkos's involvement and accuracy in the case further cemented his reputation as a psychic detective. But the Boston Strangler wasn't the only high-profile case Herkos worked on. He also lent his psychic abilities to the authorities in the 1969 Manson family murders, one of the most chilling crime sprees in American history. Despite his success, Herkos wasn't without controversy. In 1964, the same year he gained fame for his work on the Boston Strangler case, he was convicted in Milwaukee for impersonating an agent of the Federal Bureau of Investigation. This conviction raised questions about his credibility and the legitimacy of his psychic abilities. Herkos passed away from a heart attack at the age of 77. He left behind his wife, Stephanie Courtney, their daughter, and six children from a previous marriage. So what does Peter Herkos's story mean for the world of psychic research? His life and career have certainly left a lasting impact. While skeptics continue to question the authenticity of his abilities, his work on high-profile criminal cases cannot be ignored. His contributions to these investigations brought a new perspective to crime solving, opening the door for psychic detectives and paranormal investigators. Whether or not one believes in psychic abilities, the story of Peter Herkos serves as a reminder that sometimes the most extraordinary abilities can come from the most unexpected circumstances. His legacy lives on, continuing to inspire and intrigue those who delve into the world of the psychic and the paranormal.